So I done making my other video for my fletching. What I say I'll do that, just look at my other videos. You can see that. But what I also wanted to show you is my tips. This video I'll just be quickly showing you my tips. Or uh, tips where I'll show another video how I make them. But you can start to see the tip of my arrow. This is the same arrow I fletched by the way. It's not it's made out of um uh this I can't remember if this is the right name, but it's made out of this pipe. And um, it kind of imitates bone. That's why I kind of play for anyway. But just, it really, this is really hard. It's definitely not going anywhere. And that one's good. And that's my this one, my other arrow, this is my personal arrow. Which is also flushed the same way. But, mm, I have a metal tip. It's made out of a tip of a... Um, called the tip of a yeah, butter knife, and um, I got this idea for special thanks to uh, Johnny J. Rambo 111 because he used graphite, I think he said. Couldn't really understand him, but he used um, some kind of thing off it. It looked like it was just a little a butter knife, and when I tried it, definitely couldn't do any of that stuff with my butter knife because it was a lot harder. But I can shoot this into any kind of wood, I mean, I can just like the wall with it and it'll stay there and it goes in. It'll go the whole way into a tree. No problem. It'll just stick there. It's my little favorite arrowheads. It's really nice. But here's my arrowhead. I got them two. And I'll put them on a switch string. This one you kind of see a little bit of tape and glue because when I was splitting the shaft with the arrowhead it split too far because the wood is really weird. Like this one piece of wood is weird. And it split too far. So I had to glue it together, but it still works fine and it's good. And that is my video. And comment, subscribe. Thank you.